Hi and welcome to Signal Sound Studio Tutorials. My name is Jesper and this is the day I start my series about uh, VCV rack and modular software synths. This episode is about finding VCV rack and install it and a little bit about the homepage and um, how to update and all kinds of stuff. So if we go to um, our internet browser and write VCV rack, VCV rack, um, it will come as the first one. Just hit that, and we'll come into the home page. So. The only thing you have to do is, well, create an account. I have done it and it's free. So don't worry about uh, anything that costs anything. Then click uh, on, I'm using Mac, you can use uh, Windows and uh, Linux. Uh, but hit one of them and it will download. So I've downloaded it and come here double click this and install it if it's on a Mac uh, it will install it by itself uh, and it will install the VCV rack bridge on uh, its location on Mac so if we go I'll just minimize this into Ableton So, um, mine is a little different than yours probably because I have a lot of VSTs, so I have them in categories. So if I have it in instruments, I have modular and then VCV bridge. If this is the first time you're loading in a VST, you have to go into preferences, then you have to go to plugins and uh, here you can see uh, our plugin sources uh, and you have to uh, set this to on. If you're on a Mac, then open this. you will go to uh, Mac, library, audio, uh, plugins, and go down to VST and it will drop in this menu. When it's done, you hit plugins and it will be here. But if you do have uh, folders like I do, then it will be in here. Hit the bridge on. When the bridge is on, you can go, I've put mine in this bar down here. Uh, otherwise, it will be in programs and I have a lot. Then we have rec, open rec. Okay. Then you will have this. Then you will have to log in to your account uh, afterwards. But then you only have the fundamental uh, stuff. So all of these you will have, nothing else. So go to plugins and all of yours would be blue. But I, I just want it all. You don't need it to begin with, but I just hit all of the blue ones and they will turn red. Nothing else would happen. Um, I have one that's blue. And that's because I can hit manual. These are pretty cool, but it has a bug. So uh, mine would crash. So this one, um, I would not recommend, not yet. If we go down to it again, you can see it's five months since they did something with it. So if it says one day, I would probably install it again because then they corrected it. Um, then there are some, let me see if I can find some 
here. Uh, well, desktop is uh, when you install it. Cora is when you install it. But then you have like this one. You have to click here and uh, let's try get zip files. And it will open up uh, Google Drive and you can say download. We can go into my download. And then you have like this. In here there's a lot uh, of modules. So if I'm just going to close down Win uh, or Ableton. Oops, don't save. Um, then you will have to go in um, manual and go to documents, rack, plugins, and then you can see this welcome. It's right here, uh, and then it will work in here. You see, then we have this. So now you can see up here it says update plugins. So every time you hit the blue ones and it turns red, it activates it. So if you're logged in, it will say, Okay, I've chosen that, hit that, and now it will. Um, update all your plugins that uh, you selected. When it's done, press OK and it will close down and then you can open it up again. Now there's no red dot and then you're good to go. So this video was only about getting this VREC and installing it. There's one more thing. Um, let me find this. So if we go in here again and hit VCV, VCV, break patch, patches. There's like a platform in here. You can also uh, log in. Uh, right now I am logged in. If you make a patch, you can add it in here. Uh, upload a patch, ask a que question, or write a tutorial. You can also um, go in here for v uh, VCV rec and you can go patch, category, I want a sequencer, I want ready to go. Uh, the other ones is need help, inactive and work in progress. Let's say ready to go, sort by dates, views, let's say downloads and go. Then it will search only for patches and you can download them. And trust me, there's a ton presets in here people made and you can upload yours um, so yeah that's it please uh, hit like and subscribe see you next time bye